And also Special Counsel Robert Mueller has finally cracked the whip. And the U.S. Department of Justice has now issued criminal indictments against 12 Russian intelligence officials accused of interfering in the 2016 presidential election. Now, all 12 members Good are afternoon. part of the Russian intelligence hey, agency and are accused of stealing usernames and passwords of volunteers Hillary Clinton's campaign. Now, the charges include conspiracy to commit an offense against U.S. aggravated identity theft, and also conspiracy to launder money as well. Now, they're also accused of releasing the stolen emails on the web. Keystrokes, take screenshots, and exfiltrate or remove data from those computers. The defendants accessed email accounts of volunteers and employees of a U.S. presidential campaign, including the campaign chairman, starting in March of 2016. Well, the indictment has now raised the stakes for the summit next week between President Trump and Russian President Vladimir Putin. Remember, Trump has time and again dismissed the Russian probe as nothing more than a political witch hunt and has denied any involvement of the Russians in the elections. In the meanwhile, anticipation before the Trump-Putin summit is steadily building up. In a light-hearted statement, the U.S. President Donald Trump has told reporters are checkers in England that he will tell the Russian president to stay out of the elections as and when he meets him next week. We have been discussing this with Germany. The president has made... Mr. President, will you tell Putin to stay out of U.S. elections? Yes. Thank you.